Happening right now in New Haven, it is one of the best events in the Elm City, the New Haven Grand, New Haven Grand Prix and a Beats Feast. That's where I find Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland, who is live in the center of it all. Matt. Uh, hi there, Stefanito. It's like a big party down here in downtown New Haven, one that's only going to grow with the crowd size and the excitement as the night goes on, you know, because we're talking about combining New Haven's world-class pizza along with the excitement of these big bicycle races right here in the heart of downtown New Haven. Now, the city builds it as a can't-miss event, and it's really a spectacle as the races go on into the night. They actually just started one race. We've got 75 racers in this one, so hopefully you'll see them coming up uh, Chapel Street in a bit, but let's talk about those races. We've got professional and amateur cycles from all over, all different age groups, qualifications, circling downtown. They'll start right here on Chapel, turn on to High, down Elm, onto Temple, and then back up to Chapel, looping part of Yale and New Haven's Green. First race started at 4, and then they'll go about till about 9 o'clock tonight. Now, while those cyclists are getting a workout, those less inclined, well, they can work on expanding their waistlines with some of New Haven's best pizza. Across the way, we've got the Abitz Feast and Beer Garden going on till about uh, 10 o'clock tonight, 40 vendors, and also new this year, we've got a pizza relay. Two teams will actually be running the same race course that the cyclists are on. They'll actually run the race course with a pizza box. they got to carry it with one hand, and then they'll cross the line. All the money raised tonight there, that'll go to the Connecticut Cycling Advancement Program that works to expand cycling opportunities for young kids all across Connecticut. So, still plenty of time to get down here to check it out. The whole event goes on till 10 o'clock tonight, right here in downtown New Haven. Quite the event. A lot of people down here. They expect it to only grow as the night goes on. For now, the we're live with the Mobile Newsroom in New Haven. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.